On Thanksgiving Eve, the five alarm fire at Laren Farm in Belmont drew the attention of everyone nearby. And I looked out my sliding glass window and the whole sky was just gleaming orange, bright orange. Rhiannon and Fee rushed over along with friends and other neighbors. And we were just out all night with them trying to save as many animals as we could. The people who lived here, the carpenters, got out safely, but their house and barn are destroyed. Fee says it's more than 200 years old. You know, they're 77 and 81, and to lose everything that you've ever had, it's just totally heartbreaking. The carpenters also lost a dog, cat, and about a dozen goats. Three police officers suffered smoke inhalation trying to save them. It really is a tragic event that happened to such great people. Um, it, it was a shock. But they were able to save a goose, ducks, some of the cats and dogs. They've either been rehomed or are with the carpenters. And one family took in their mule, named Sunshine, plus several chickens. The carpenters are now trying to slowly get back on their feet. With these animals safe and a GoFundMe page set up for them, their community is helping in every way possible. We're just all trying to pull together as much as we can and have fun out of it and, and raise as many funds as we can for them because they're just really great people. And if you'd like to help the Carpenters out, you can visit this story on our website at WMUR.com. There you'll find a link to a fundraiser for them. In Belmont, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.